bikes on the road this time of year. It's great exercise and there's some great scenery around here as well. As Eric Dobratz tell us, tells us, one program in our state is helping young riders learn and thrive in the sport of cycling. Cycling definitely can be an intimidating sport. That's where the Connecticut Cycling Advancement Program comes in. Every Tuesday night, riders of all ages and skill levels hit Rentschler Field in East Hartford to learn about cycling. The great thing is that the sport allows them all to come together and really share that, uh, that passion that they enjoy. David Hoyle is the executive director of CCAP. The group started three years ago. The goal? To organize kids in the sport of cycling. So we organize a league that they all race in and train in together. And uh, we're in middle schools, high schools. Uh, we also start youth travel team programs. And the training program may seem a little unorthodox at first. So we're going to start off with the bumping drill. So what I want you guys to do is ride down to the fence and then ride back, right? And what you're, the goal of this is close as possible to your partner and bumping shoulders. After the bumping drill, it was time for a game. We are playing bicycle football, other words known as garbage ball. Garbage ball? This is the best game in the world. Bicycle football? Yeah, I wasn't sure what that was either, but the game helps teach cyclists balance and ways to help control their bikes and their bodies. Let's go, let's go! 13-year-old Xander Jones has been racing since he was eight. Joining this group has really helped him. It's made me a lot less sketchy of a rider by learning which wheels to take, which side to draft on. It's just taught me how to be a better rider in general. It's definitely something that it takes a little while to, to catch on. You know, at first it can be really frustrating because you're like, man, you know, I'm not as fast as these guys are. How do they do that? But once you catch on, it can really pay off. It's the great thing about cycling, you know, is that you can really take it as far as you want competitively. In East Hartford, I'm Eric Dobratz for the Sports Edge. And Eric tells us there's no charge for cyclists under 18, but registration is required. And again, that's every Tuesday at Rensselaer Field in East Hartford.